Good Monday morning, Glads. I'm Cheyenne Gallier. And I'm Isaac Fleet, and this is your KWHS News. November college visits kick off this week, so get ready for these dates. Remember to pick up your pass from the Counseling Center for these visits during advisory and at lunch. Here's the lineup. Tomorrow, the University of Wyoming reps will be here, and on Wednesday, Luther College will visit us. The following week, the reps from Fort Hayes State will be here on Tuesday, November 13th. On Thursday, November 15th, the reps from UCCS are scheduled to be here. After Thanksgiving, you can visit with the reps from Adams State who have scheduled a visit on November 29th. Students, the presentation for Discovery High School will be on Thursday, November 8th. The presentation will be during advisory and you need to check in the Counseling Center for your pass to attend this event. Seniors, interested in attending PPCC this fall? Mark your calendar for December 4th when Pikes Peak Community College will be here for application day. Be sure to sign up for your appointment in the Counseling Center before November 30th. If you missed any of these dates, check out the Counseling Center calendar or go to their website. And now we're heading to the sports desk for our Gladiator Sports Update with Ethan Simon. Good Monday morning, Glads. I'm Ethan Simon, and this is your Gladiator Sports Update. Our Gladiator football team played its final game on Friday night and ended the season with a loss. Thanks for the memories, Glads. Congratulations to our mighty Gladiator marching band, who returned from state competition with a very respectable placement. Nice work, Glads. In forensics news, our team traveled to Woodland Park over the weekend but fell short and didn't bring home the note. Up next for the forensics team is the terror invite at Palmer High School this coming Saturday. Winter sports season practices start next Monday, November 12th. Remember to pick up your sports packet with your physical form in the main office. When you return your packet, you will receive your yellow participation card. If you already have a physical on file, pick up your yellow cards in the main office now. Do not wait until the last minute to turn in your paperwork and get your card because you will not be allowed to practice. In basketball news, the boys basketball preseason camp is happening in the afternoon in Bowers Gym. If you are interested in trying out for the team, check in with Miss Miles so you can connect with Coach Johnson on camp information. Our ladies basketball team also starts their camp this afternoon and it runs through this Thursday from 3 to 4.45 in the small gym. If you are interested in trying out for the team and want to dust off your skills, come to the camp. See Coach Haas in room 2 for details. Glads, the gents volleyball tournament starts today at lunch in the small gym. If you brought your canned goods, you can get in for free, otherwise it will cost a dollar to watch the games. You can also buy a pass for three dollars to attend all the games this week. Ladies, if you are interested in wrestling for WHS this season, please see Coach Walker in the Counseling Center for more details and information. That's it for your Monday Gladiator Sports Update. I'm Ethan Simon. Now back to Cheyenne and Isaac for more news. Thanks for the update, Ethan. The drama department production of Dracula, The Fall Play, will run this week on Friday and Saturday at 7 p.m. in the auditorium. Tickets are $3 for students and $5 for adults. Come out and support your gladi actors. And speaking of drama, auditions for Little Women will be held next week on Tuesday and Wednesday after school in the auditorium. Remember to pick up a monologue and select a song which are on the theater and choir room doors. If you have any questions or need more details, see Miss Caps or Mr. Larson. Hey, Glads. Have you returned your pink federal aid forms yet? We cannot stress how critical these are to our school, so please return your completed copies to your first hour teacher or directly to the attendance office. And now, here's the lunch crew with our lunch menu for today and Tuesday. Hello, Miss Betsy here. I'm flying solo today. Happy Monday, welcome back. Hope you all had a great weekend. Today's oven fried chicken, mashed potatoes and gravy, and then on Tuesday, cheeseburger with Lettuce, tomato, onion, pickle, the whole works. So have a great one. Thanks. Bye-bye. Thanks, Miss Betsy. Students, if you have outstanding lunch charges, please pay them in the cafeteria or go online and add money to your account. If you need some academic help, check out the Thursday tutoring sessions with the NHS, stop by the library to sign up for a session and pick up your pass. Finish up the semester on a strong note. Glads, you still have time to order your yearbook before the price goes up at the end of the month. You can order your yearbook in the business office or go to yearbookforever.com and order online. The cost is $55. Seniors, if you missed the Herf Jones rep on Friday, remember, you have to get your orders in by Thanksgiving, and you can also place your order online. Student government is hosting the Harvest of Giving Food Drive from November 5th through the 16th. All donations collected will be used by the 180 Club for their annual food drive. Please be generous. 
as all these donations go to the family of students in our school. Bring your donations to room 103 and put them in your class box so you can earn Charlie Cup points. Additionally, we have some dress up days to have some fun with this event. Here's the calendar of dress up days for this week. Tuesday is the first day of kindergarten. Show us what you got by wearing what you wore your first day of school. Wednesday is Decades Day. Select a decade and like totally dress up like it. Listen, it could be groovy or like, you know, lame -o. Whatever. Thursday is Character Day. No, not like honesty or virtue, but like Bart Simpson or that guy from Rick and Morty. Yeah, that's it. Friday is Color Wars Day. Wear your class color. Remember, your class earns points for this one. Also, you can come watch the Gents Volleyball Tournament for free today if you brought your canned goods. Otherwise, it will cost you a dollar. That's it for our Monday edition, Glads. I'm Cheyenne Gallier. And I am Isaac Fleet, and this was your KWHS News. Have a great week.